All right, so I'm gonna do a climb test to 18,000. We'll probably start the climb at 8,000. You know, I'm almost seven on the ground here. Oh, well, I'll kind of just uh, get like in the stabilized climb and as I pass through 8,000, I'll maybe start a timer. Actually climb it from 8 to 18. guys thanks for riding along all the way up here into the uh into outer space uh <laughs> and it kind of feels that way anyway you know you get up here and it's it's cold up here and it's getting kind of dark in the evening and it's quieter you know the motor's making so much less power it's actually getting kind of quiet and yeah man you're just so far from anything and everything up here all by yourself it is a little bit of kind of an eerie lonely interesting type of feeling but uh you know typically i'm trying to figure out how i can fly as low as i uh, possibly can safely so coming up here is a little bit of a, a, a different feeling than I'm usually out doing. But uh, sometimes crossing the mountains, you got to get up really high here in Colorado. So it's nice to have that uh, that performance to be able to do that when you need to. I think I could get that number down closer to like 20 minutes if I wasn't fighting that evening descending air. The first uh, probably 4,000 plus feet that I climbed, I was not getting a good climb rate and actually was seeing a better climb rate above that, which tells me I was definitely in some kind of descending air. 
And uh, I think that hurt my time, but hey, you know what? Either way, uh, 22 or 22 and a half minutes is pretty, pretty decent to climb from 8 to 18,000 uh, in a non-turbocharged airplane. So what can I really say? You know, performs pretty well. I'll take it. Anyway, uh, stay tuned. I'll be, uh, you know, of course, making some more videos coming up. Um, haven't been able to focus as much on that here in the last few weeks. This is my busy time at work and, uh, been really getting slammed with that and, uh, you know, I had a BFR to, to get knocked out and, and some other projects and things going on. So haven't been able to do quite as much flying as I, as I'd like to, but you know, fall's coming and, uh, typically fall's the best time around here for flying. So definitely looking forward to that. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you guys when I see you. Take care.